know what the problem with Hollywood is? They make shit. Unbelievable, unremarkable shit. Now, I'm not some grungy filmmaker looking for existentialism through the haze of bong smoke. No, it's easy to pick apart bad acting, shots at a directing, and pure moronic stringing of words that studios refer to as prose. No, I'm talking about lack of realism. Realism. Not the pervasive element of modern American cinematic vision. Take Dog Day Afternoon, for example. Arguably Pacino's best work. Short of Scarface and Godfather Part 1, of course. Masterpiece in directing, easily Lumet's best. The acting, the directing, the cinematography, the screenplay, all top-notch. But... They didn't push the envelope. Now what if in Dog Day Afternoon, Sony really wanted to get away with it? What if... Now here's the tricky part. What if he started killing the hostages right away? No mercy, no quarter. Meet our demands or the pretty blonde in the bell bottoms gets it in the back of her fucking head. What? Still no bus? Come on. How many innocent victims spattered across the window would it take for the city to change its policy in hostage situation? Remember, this is 1976. There is no CNN, there is no CNBC, and there is no internet. Now fast forward to today. Present time, same situation. Do you realize how the media would make a frenzy out of the situation? In a couple of hours, it will be the biggest story all the way from Boston to Budapest. 10 hostages die, 20, 30. Bam, bam, bam. All caught in high def, computer enhanced, color corrected. You can practically taste the brain matter. All for what? A bus, a plane, a couple of million dollars that's federally insured? I don't think so.